they're blaming you because they feel guilty. Please scroll on. If this doesn't resonate, you know this already. I'm just here to confirm your intuition. You will not be deceived. They're, this is someone who you've had some kind of heated discussion with. Um, doesn't even have to be in person. It could have been over text or email or something, but um, be patient with me. Like This is someone who I feel like I'm supposed to tell you to be patient with them, and if you can't, just ignore them because they're lashing out. Um, the blame is real, for real. Like They are pretending not to care. There's a whole lot of like just not wanting to admit what they did, the guilt. They feel guilty, and it's just easier for people to mask and blame someone else than to own their guilt. And I'm not saying you need to... Forgive this person. I'm just telling you what's going on. Okay, two cards immediately. So, okay, these two cards came out. I don't want to lose you, and you saw through me. Now, <laughs> okay, by the way they're acting, you probably wouldn't believe this. Don't want to lose you. But I think you know deep down that's how they feel. They are pushing you away. I shouldn't even say that. It's not even that. They are acting, honestly, I'm getting more of an aggressive vibe. And you see through it. I think you see through it every time. You you know what's going on here. You know who this person is. Or people. It doesn't have to be just one person. This honestly it might be some kind of gang stalking. It might be a group of people doing this to you. Or it could be your partner or someone. I don't know. But however it resonates, uh, you will not be deceived. Whoa. Immediately. Bad influences. Okay. Not just. Okay. All, all right. How, how to put this bad people okay i shouldn't say bad people um bad advice they're talking to people getting bad advice it's making the thing it's making this whole thing worse you know and i wouldn't add fuel to this fire that's the whole thing is you saw through them you know you already know i think you're wondering if you should say something say something if you have to like i'm not saying let people get away with it or get away with things like it don't i'm not saying don't speak up for yourself if it's a if you're, it's a situation where you're unsafe or whatever. What I'm saying is don't add fuel to the fire in some kind of petty drama. You know what I mean? Don't do it just to be petty. Oh, good look. Radiate positivity. The best thing you can do is act like it's not even getting to you. Act like it's not happening. Um, no. It, this is because they know what they did. They're afraid the truth's going to come out. No one trashes your name harder than someone who's afraid you're going to tell the truth. And that's what they're afraid of. They, they know what they did to you. And they have been, you know, this is someone who has been saying stuff about you for a long time trying to get people on their side when you know it, it's just crazy people see through them too like seriously they're pretending not to care they're just there's a whole lot of pretending going on okay it's very passive aggressive and in other cases aggressive but um but passive aggressive well part of that is aggressive you know what i mean so just because it's passive doesn't mean it can't be aggressive anyway ugh, keep going this card has come out so much lately Oh, don't look back at this, okay? Keep going past it. These people are behind you. Just, I'm telling you, unless it's absolutely necessary, like you have to stand up for yourself in a court of law or police or HR or something, I wouldn't, you know, don't do anything to add fuel to this on social media. In fact, you know, just change it. Just distract everybody by talking about something else, by doing something else. Distraction. Distract yourself. Nothing stands in your way. Keep going. I think you're afraid this is going to stand in your way somehow. It's probably been pretty traumatic, especially if it's been a gang stalking or cyber stalking. Um, that can be really traumatic in a weird way, and I'm sorry that you're going through this, but nothing stands in your way. You, The more positive you are, the better off you're going to be, and I know it sucks because these people don't deserve that. I know. I know. God sees all. They're going to get their karma. No weapon formed against you shall prosper, and you have control over your thoughts. Oh, see, that's what you're going to have to do. Like, look, let's just claim this. No weapon. Mm -mm, you have nothing to, nothing to fear. No weapon formed against you shall prosper. And you have control over your thoughts. They want to get to you. They want you to fear, okay? You don't. <laughs> oh, be patient. Yeah, okay. The, the patience you're going to have is just to get through this, okay? Keep your mouth shut and keep going. Nothing stands in your way. You have control over your thoughts. It is spoken. It is written. And so it is. Amen.